Okay, good morning. Today I got some pretty sweet science stuff to show you. I'm opening Noeo. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. Noeo Science, and it's pretty cool. Like, I'm quite happy with the purchase and the price point of that. First, let me show you some products of the day. So check this out. I know you're like, wow, that looks cool. Normally, they're supposed to be little hex bugs. They're little tiny mini robots and they run around here and you make your own little playground. And they run around and run around and I set it up and I'm not kidding you, the hex bugs ran away. They ran away, like they're real fast. They're real fast, they're little tiny things and they're real, I mean you can get them all sizes, but they're really fast and I couldn't find them and I was like, ugh. But I did not want to show you it because it's super cool. So I showed you it. So next up the part of the day, this is a model, a molecule model kit we were using it this morning. I don't know where my carbons went that I made that disappeared. So if you can only get one book out of that set I showed you, get the molecule book because from this you will learn what atoms are. You will learn that they have their arms are symbolized electrons. And so every atom has electrons and that's how they connect. So salt just has like one, they're really tiny. And we also learned, so interestingly enough, we went through here and we started, so I pulled out the atom kit and we're making the atoms, right? And it tells you in here what re color represents what. And so the hydrogen rule has only one arm, so the rule is it can only have one bond. Okay, so we went all the way, and so we're going through it and we're like at carbon. And what's interesting about carbon is that carbon is what makes atom, is what makes is what makes diamonds. So we looked it up in this book here. This book's only 11 bucks. We cross-referenced it in this book only to learn that wouldn't you wouldn't you know it? It's actually the the most they consider it the most important element of life because it it's like the backbone of DNA and things like that. So that was pretty exciting. So if you can only get the one book, I'll put it down there and then you can have yourself like it's I like it because you're not doing wasted time. In 20 minutes, we learned about atoms and electrons and molecules and, uh, oh, my hair. Anyway, you're good to go. Okay, okay, so check this out. This is, this is Noeo Science. It comes in a little box, got that on. I chose the physics one, but I'm gonna go order the other two. Super cool. For 200 bucks, they send you the experiment stuff that you're gonna need, which again, just because I'm overseas, I didn't, I mean, there's no dollar store, I can go track down stuff. It's got different kits, physics, so it's very clearly laid out. And it's got some cool stuff in it, and I'll show you. I'm gonna show you what I really liked about it. One of the things I really liked, for 200 bucks, it comes with all the books, tons of books. Now you can get a lot of these at the library. The only ones you couldn't get at the library, I would say, are these. These are, comic books. Are they the best comics I ever read? No, but they're, it's just an interesting concept that they're graphic novels and they're about, yeah, they're about light and forces and motion and magnetism. Now this is for grade level one to three. So you can do it anytime around there. So I would almost consider, I would almost consider, I think if you got the three of these boxes, the chemistry, the physics and the biology, I think if you got the three of them, and then you just did Mr. Q's science. I think you'd be, I mean, I think that's sufficient. I think that is sufficient because Mr. Q's science will teach you everything you need to know going up to high school, um, for high school. So I think that would be sufficient. So it's got, of course, some of these books, The Who is Galileo. We've all read The Who is, and you can get them at the library. It's got a lot more. Oh, it even comes with an Usborne one I haven't seen before. How fancy is that? I'm gonna add that to my Usborne pile. Yeah, interesting. The story of inventions. I was looking for an inventor's kit or a robot kit. So if anyone has one, let me know. And then it comes the simple machines. So simple machines again, the intro to mechanical engineering. So I just think it's a solid kit. Is that it in there? Is that all we got? That is all we got. So let's, ooh, let's check out. So this book, how do you lift a line? I'm pretty sure you can get the library. A lot of these you might be able to get the library, but that's not the point. The point is, is that for 200 bucks, it comes with all your books. That does not happen. Ooh, now and Ben, I've never heard of that one. Ooh, and it doesn't have that much text. That is a winner when you're dealing with little kids because I find I can teach little kids even more if it doesn't have. Now we have, oh, this is the little kid's first big book of space. A space one we don't have. That's kind of exciting because we have the little book of why and it's okay, it's okay. I thought it would be more exciting than it was. I thought my kids would adore it more um, than, than they actually did. 
but very interesting. A nice book on space. I like it. So, so it's covering a lot of topics. So let's look at now the instructor's guide is your usual instructor's guide. No, 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 no. It's it is no, it's not. It's not. It's not. I'm thinking of I ordered a I have the um the HBL I got from Sunlight and that came too, and I'm gonna show you that. Okay, so I'm not gonna show you that like in this video. So daily lessons, plans, and readings for experiments. Okay, so it's got the intro of course, so more about course. What I like is look, overview, it's got the experiments that you're gonna do. So there's not a ton of text for me to read. Day one, what is speed? What is acceleration? Okay, so it's just got some concepts that you're gonna learn. So I like it, I like it, I like, I could not like it more right now. I think it's great, I think it's great. I think it's definitely worth your money. I think it's worth your money, I think it's worth your time. This is the experiment guide. Now you can actually just get, I believe, just these three books for 75 bucks. I think, I think, or it was really reasonable. Um, it, it seemed really reasonable. There was something that was really reasonable on the site, and I was like, wow. I didn't totally understand their site, but that's what a lot of sites I don't understand. So simple machines. So it actually has information for working with those simple machines. So I definitely think that is cool. So this is the experiment book, right? So question, what do you see when you look into a mirror? All right, and then it's got this, and actually that would correspond with that light book, because I was reading that light graphic novel, and he's talking about a mirror. All right, and then what we learned. Okay, so it's got, and the experiments don't seem to have things that are too prompt, two bendy straws, a rubber ball, a ping pong ball, balloon toy car. So the, I guess the ping pong ball would be the most difficult to track down. But push pins, sandpaper, chopsticks, things you can, I, I probably you could track down. Not as easy experiments as Mr. Q's, like uh, supply-wise, as Mr. Q's or as, which is for like middle school, um, older kids or for the um, the real science for kids, but still. So this is just the manual and I guess I wouldn't even, I'm not gonna order another manual because I don't think, like this is just something we can just use with the plain notebooks that I always talk about. You can just get a plain notebook or a lab book and that can be your lab book for the year and then you can just write your questions up because that's all it is, is writing your answers or drawing your answers depending on the age. Can you say please like and subscribe? Please like you like. And hit the bell for notifications. Hit the bell, you know what that's <laughs> <laughs>